Brianna believes that her brother Omari has sexually abused her four-year-old daughter. <laughs> and her suspicions grew stronger after Omari confessed to trying to sleep with a teenage family member. <laughs> but Omari denies doing anything to Brianna's daughter. And now, their mother April says these accusations have torn her family apart. <laughs> they all need the truth today. I believe that my brother molested my daughter. Uh, and why do you believe that? Because she told me, um, she told me that he She told me and my mom together that he Okay, and um, before this, uh, your daughter told you this, how was your relationship with your brother? That was, you know how like you have your favorite brother? You know how you have your favorite person? Like, I have nobody else. Like, he was her father figure in her life because her dad is not there. That was my closest brother. Now he, I told him everything. He my best friend. He my best friend, you know? Right. So me and his relationship You're was- You're very, very close. Very close. And your brother babysit for your daughter, right? Yes. How, how often did he do that? Well, I work third shift. So he keeps That's her- That's like what, four to midnight or? Four to one. He keeps oh, her one. Monday through Friday, no days off. I only get Saturday and Sunday off. He keeps her from 4.30 to one o'clock in the morning. Did your daughter say anything other than Yes, she was doing a lot of sexual things, and I just didn't approve of it. So I went to her and I asked her, I said, why are you doing them things? And she pointed at him and another family member that have done it to her. And I confirmed him then, and he denied it then. He said, I won't do that. I won't do it. And I, I just couldn't believe it because, like I said, that's my favorite. I just don't believe that he would do something like that until the day of, it was June, when the, a family member, she was like, what's wrong? And then I was like, I just can't get this out of my head. It just is bothering me. It bothers me. It bothers me. And she was like, she grabbed my arm. She was like, Brian, I have something to tell you. So I'm looking at her because I see her face. And she just like, well, I believe that he did it because he did it to me. You know, so I'm like, so then I pulled the car over and I just broke down. I and just, obviously I this is a much down. older family member. She's a teenager. Okay. And he admitted it to doing what, it to her. What did, what did the family member say that Omari did to her? He supposedly rubbed on her or whatever. He Weakened supposedly rubbed on her and she grabbed his hands or whatever. But it was, he's supposed to try he to have he, sex with her. He tried to have sex with right. her. And it's, it's a family blood. It's, you know? it's family. Thank you. Um, did you take your daughter to like a, a doctor or a medical facility, hospital? No. No. And I, I'm, I'm just curious. Why wouldn't you do that? Because I just didn't believe it. I didn't believe it at first until afterwards. When until, after until my the told me, I just didn't believe yeah. it because she's four. Like, right. I didn't believe it. Okay. And now, are you upset with your mom? I'm very upset with and her. And why are you upset with her? Because we have a history of this going on with our family, and she was the one that protected everybody. A history of everybody. sexual abuse? Yes, she was the one that came up and protected everybody and sent that person to jail. So everybody knows, and I'm like, Mama, you're supposed to protect me, and she, don't, she wasn't protecting me. She just kept him around, like even after the other family Do member. Do you feel that she believes him over you? She don't know what to do because right. it's her, it's her, her son. it's her son. I'm right. her daughter. Let's bring out your brother, Omari. Hey, I don't like this, Brianna. You know this is way beyond me. I can't hear You've been knowing me for way too long. Like you know, I'm, I'm not capable of doing no and like that. This. But and still, like, though. No, hold on. Let me finish. This is my niece, Brianna. I love her to death. Like I can't even put it in words. Like you know, you don't know how many times I have to hail back tears for this. Like, it was one time where I couldn't because she came to me like, why don't you play with me? And like, I, I, it crushed me. I had to cry for that. Like, this, it was like too much for me at that point. And I just couldn't do it. And I, I would never do nothing like that to my niece. And about this other family member, I didn't try to have sex with her. Like, I, I might have touched her and it was inappropriate and I'd apologize for it. Why, I did, never do why it again. did you touch her inappropriately for her? I wasn't, I wasn't in my right mind at the time. I was intoxicated and it, it just happened. She was very close with you. Yeah, this my best friend to the end. I ain't, even after this, is we still gonna be like this. It's like, and then we never As long really, as you pass this light attack. Yeah, exactly, because I'm gonna pass it. Yeah. I, I couldn't, I, person would have told me I was gonna be on Steve Wilkins about my niece. I would have slapped him in the face. And I wouldn't even go, ain't one have been there. I, I, I don't believe it. But you did. You were saying, you said you could bring me on and the And then I'll just show. say that. I told you, call the police. Let's go on Steve Wilco. And I did it just And then, things. look, where we at now on Steve Wilco. <laughs> your mom is here, and obviously, your mom is torn because this is her son. Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. Okay. Uh, let's bring out your guy's mother, April. <laughs> How are you doing, April? Fine. Um, I, 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 a terrible situation to be in, yes, right? Yes. Uh, it sounds like there's been some bad things that happened in the past, uh, but your daughter says that you did a great job protecting, uh, took action when action needed to be taken. But now, here we come along. She has a, a child at a very young age, and uh, you're helping with the baby. Amari's there babysitting. And what exactly did the child say? The child said that Amari was humping on me, and he I'm thinking in my mind that he must have had sex with the child. And it was like, it hurt me and Brianna because we looked at each other like, no, not him. Not, not him. Not the one we trusted. You know, we thought it would right. be other family members. So, like, he knew that he was the one that yeah. I trusted him. Is it possible him. that it, it is somebody else and not him? She uh, really well, don't. She said his name, so. She it's says, she, and, and she's very verbal, right? Right. And she knows who's who? Yes. Okay. So, and she said Omari. Yes. Okay. Um, do you believe he did this? Hmm, yes. You do believe he did like, this? Why would the child say it? Yeah, I mean... Like, the child have no reason to lie. He is an adult, and she don't have no reason to lie. Okay. Um, if Omari fails his lie detector test, what's going to happen? What's going to happen? Yeah, what's going to happen? That's on Brianna the truth. That's her child. She has to... No, but you're... She. But she... I understand that. No, no, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What I understand what you're saying is she's going to have to take action because she's the mom. Yeah. But you, as the mother of your son, who, if he would fail this test and he show that he did this, what would what would you what would you do? What would your feelings be towards your son? I would be disgusted with him. Like I wouldn't want to be around him no more because it happened. Like I would look at him as a child molester. Like, yeah, like I don't look at him. Like you know, so I would be very upset, mom? very very I like. Show y'all the truth behind this because like. I know that y'all feel like I did this. I could y'all ain't gotta say it. I said I just said you, I feel like you, you did. You just said it now. You just said yeah. it now. But yeah. you ain't gotta say. I'm talking about before we even came on the show and just the actions and the way y'all treated me before. Like this not me and y'all know that. And like I said, we here to get this truth. That's, that's what and and if he fails to lie detector test, what will you do? I'm pressing charges to the high the high extent that I can press. <laughs> press charges when you said it's happening in our family. Why would you press charges because when you can go this to is my daughter. Like, I'm you can forgive him. Like, him you don't, no, don't have not, to be no, around her. No, you don't have no. to be so around her. So you would her. encourage her no. not to press charges? Well, I'm just saying, but it's, it should be forgiven. She just said it was in our family. But it not happened then. So why you can't just, why you can't just say, I forgive you if you love but him I, like you say you do? Baby, no, no, this is my baby. This is my daughter. But I feel like if he did it, he tortured how he did my baby. He needs to feel how she feels for the rest of her life. You don't know if people really get tortured in jail. Well, so how do we know what's going to happen then? Why do we need to go there? Like, Ma'am, believe me, from the bottom of my heart, I hope this young man passes. But the reason I have no interest in her daughter, your granddaughter, being abused. Nobody wants that. Nobody right. wants to believe right. that. And the reason of why I'm sending him to jail is to stop this family curse that, that we have on us. Stop it. It is stop it. No, that's not. Why that's do not why you don't feel Catherine okay. is after Catherine, what what if you go to Catherine and you give her the money? Catherine, Catherine is after you. You know, you know man, you can, I, I say this, you should really you stop can, talking. Why? I, I, jail? What, really. what you gonna stop? Can you relate to this story? Need my help? Call one 888 steve 7 you came here and we asked you, Amari, have you ever sexually touched Brianna's four-year-old daughter? You answer no, and the results for Omari's lie detector test is that Omari told the truth. But what did you expect me to do? What did I supposed to do if like, my daughter told me that he her? And then like, I just want to set the record straight because I'm I'm backstage hearing you say lies. Like, you talked about all the girlfriends I had. How are you gonna say I didn't have none? You had okay. one. You, you had one. Well, stop. No, no, no. I know, at the 
I was not serious. He had one. Did he have any girlfriends? He just had one okay, girlfriend. Okay, okay, okay. It was more than one. We yeah, are not one. here about how many yeah, girlfriends Yeah, I just wanted to get that out there. It's going to be on okay. TV. Okay, hold on. I said I'm no, sorry. Uh, uh, you don't have to. But you know I said what? I'm sorry, though, because I'm hurt, too. That's very nice. But you did what you should do. You know, so. Um, especially in the situation that you've uh, been in almost your whole life, where you said there is a history of sexual abuse, Oops. you took the you you have to you have to do that to protect your child, um, and 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 I know it, it drove a wedge between you and your brother, but I, I love when you said no matter what you still feel about your sister, yeah. this is not going to change things. You got to know that your sister's doing what she's supposed yeah, to do. I, I, I protect her. Because no, you love the little girl, right? Yeah, I love her a lot. Like, she this, loved this, him, and that's why I'm, I was yeah. like torn because that's, right. like I said, her daddy is not around, so okay. this is all who she knew. Some people are misguided. If somebody hurts your child, commits a crime against them, you do everything you can to put that person in jail. Good luck to you. Good luck to you. I'm really happy for you.